206 लाख रुपए 600,000 दैट्स व्हाट यू आर गोइंग टू गेट आफ्टर एक्चुअली वर्किंग दिस पर्टिकुलर इंटर्नशिप ऑल राइट दिस इंटर्नशिप इज एक्चुअली वन ऑफ द बेस्ट बेस्ट ऑफ द बेस्ट इन द वर्ल्ड एंड पर्सनली आई एक्चुअली फेल एट इट बट आई वांट यू टू गो अहेड एंड गेट दिस इंटर्नशिप एंड लेट मी नो इन द कमेंट्स डाउन बिलो व्हेन यू गेट इट बिकॉज़ दिस इज एक्चुअली वंस इन अ लाइफ टाइम एक्सपीरियंस लेट मी टेल यू व्हाट दिस इज ऑल अबाउट देखिए सर्न की इंटर्नशिप है यू यू मे ऑलरेडी नो सर्न व्हाट सर्न इज इट वर्क्स इन न्यूक्लियर टेक्नोलॉजी राइट एंड एसेंशियली अ लॉट ऑफ ग्रेट थिंग्स दे हैव ऑलरेडी डन इन द पास्ट आई एम प्रीटी श्योर दैट यू मे हैव रीड इट इन योर साइंस बुक्स इफ यू हैव ऑलरेडी टेकन अप साइंस प्रीवियसली बट द द गोल ओवर हियर इज नॉट जस्ट टू वर्क एट सर्न इट्स टू वर्क एट सर्न इन स्विट्जरलैंड they will invite you over there they will pay you all the expenses and you will get to learn a lot while contributing to the success of cern now like i said they have two internship programs and both of them will open up basically start accepting applications in november 2022 remember these applications are going to be for the summer 2023 internship term that means ki agar abhi apply karoge then you will be getting the internship in summer 2023 that's somewhere around june july all right Now what are these two internship programs let's talk about them one by one the first one is the cern summer student program it is fully funded you get to work on some of the best biggest experiments that are going on in the world these experiments are usually in physics engineering or computing mostly physics is also particle physics by the way and this internship is somewhere between 8 to 13 weeks long that means that this will be the best summer of your life in most cases if you get selected the second one here is the cern open lab summer student program it is also fully funded over here however you are working on advanced it projects so this is for the computing guys out there there are also visits to external companies in switzerland that you will be going on under this internship program and this one is 9 weeks long remember for most of you who are worried about oh my college end date is this will i be able to make it remember they have multiple start dates so you can actually start throughout june and july you know there are multiple dates that you can go ahead and start this internship if you get selected let's talk about what you guys are going to love the most allowances what kind of compensation do you get while working this internship so basically every single day that you actually work this internship you will get 90 swiss francs that's 90 chf or which is very similar to 90 euros to be uh, very fair and if you convert that in indian rupees that's somewhere around 7500 rupees per day that you're getting this is just to cover your accommodation and the meals in switzerland rest of the things for your travel allowances from your home country to switzerland and going back from switzerland to your home country you will also be compensated for that as well at the end of your internship if you have already done an international trip you would know that health insurance is a major important thing especially if you're going somewhere for more than 30 days well you get cern's comprehensive health insurance coverage as well over here and finally on top of that well this may not exactly look like allowance this is support if you need any help finding accommodation near the cern you will also get help with that let's talk about the eligibility criteria what are the qualifications required number 1 you should be either a bachelor's or a master's student remember phd students are not able to apply for this one i'm sorry about that but there's more if you're going for the open lab program you must be specializing in computing any form of computing could be cs it some network something else as well but again you should be specializing in something of that sort however if you're going for the cern summer student program then you should be specializing in either physics engineering computer science or mathematics there's a couple more criteria over here the second one is that you should have completed at least 3 years of full time studies at university level now this can include bachelors and masters combined or just bachelors depends on you but you should have completed at least 3 years next you should not be graduating till at least may of 2023 of course there is one more that you should have not worked at cern in any capacity for more than 3 months finally your knowledge of english is going to be a mandate and that is a requirement and if you can speak french that is going to be a massive advantage as well i'm pretty sure that you would get some bonus points for that as well Finally let's go over the documents required. Number 1 a CV which is basically a, just a detailed version of your resume you need that and that is very very important. Do not disregard the quality of the CV because this is probably the only document you're sending them based on which they are going to be shortlisting you. There is of course a requirement of your transcripts so you can understand that your CGPA plays a major role in this one. Finally you need two recommendation letters, two LORs from people who have seen you work and of course if these can be research advisors or people from your college who have done phd's and have been into research 
and they can comment on your research capacity, that would be golden. By the way, if you need help with recommendation letters, did you know that on ymgrad.com you have a service for that where we can actually personally help you write really strong recommendation letters which you can take to your recommenders who will then go ahead and do the processing with them. If you're interested, feel free to check it out. The link will always be as mentioned in my description. Guys, remember, while this does not actually state that you need a SOP or a statement of purpose, you will still need to write a few words. I remember from the application, about why you should be selected for this program, as in why are you one of the best fits for this program instead of everyone else that is applying. So please expect to write that as well. We can also help you with that one under either the cover letter drafting service or the SOP one, that's up to you, but these are the requirements. I hope you do not miss this golden opportunity to, to actually visit Switzerland, do an internship over there and come out with six lakh rupees in your pocket. Of course, you will be spending some of it, but at the same point in time, I'm pretty sure that it's going to be a great experience. You're working with one of the best, best research organizations in the whole wide world. And I would personally not want to miss the opportunity. I wish you all the very best. And of course, subscribe to the channel for more such content in the future. Remember, there's a lot more on our Instagram page as well, where we daily post something like this. And again, these things can always benefit you. So make sure you follow us over there as well. Goodbye and take care for now. Thank you.